Moonies. I'm here with you today with my sept September 2018 Sailor Moon haul review. So uh, the first things I want to talk about are these eye drops. They came out a few months ago in Japan, but a lot of, you know, the proxies couldn't send it overseas because they contain alcohol. Now, why you would put alcohol in eye drops, I don't know, but there you go. Um, so one of my friends, uh, Mario Knight on Twitter, he was a he was in Japan on a business trip and he was able to pick up these two for me. I think there was like four in all, and uh, he just went to a local drugstore to pick these up. This one I really like. Uh, it doesn't burn my eyes as much as the other one, and look at that, so shiny with the cosmic heart there. That's so cool. I love how this theme is like Super Sailor Moon. I guess that's 2020, September 2020 is the expiration date. 25th anniversary. Yeah. Uh, so this one says ice cool. It's definitely ice cool, right? Burn your eyes out. Um, now it says you should not use uh, these eye drops with soft contact lenses. So I do wear soft contact lenses. So I would have to use this without those in. So maybe these are something I would have to just use at home in the morning or in the night. Um, so yeah, so those were that. Um, and then in September, the Sailor Moon Eternal Edition came out in English. Uh, now what's so cool about this is that it's a larger format. It's nearly as big as the old uh, Ch Chicks Comics uh, single issues. There. Uh, and honestly, I think one of the reasons why I got these, these single issues is because, you know, Sailor Moon was really meant to be seen on a large page format. Uh, Nakayoshi, which it originally appeared in, was a, you know, it's a magazine. It's, it's a large magazine. So um, you can definitely tell the difference uh, it from the smaller comics to the bigger ones. Uh, you know, it's just simple panels just make so much, so like certain panels just make so much more of an impact on a larger format. Like I think it's like 10 times more beautiful in the large page format. Um, I haven't actually sat down and read the whole thing cover to cover, but I've looked at a few key places and the translation, I love it so much more. I'm, I'm definitely much more of a person who likes to, you know, you can take more creative license, I think, to make it sound natural in English, and I really like that. And that's what the Nimbly, Nibbly? I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, <laughs> uh, sisters, uh, they did a really great job. I'm very happy so far with it. Um, and also what's cool about these, actually, so all of the pages except for the very back are this like glossy format. Look at that. Look at that. It's, isn't it so much more beautiful in the bigger format? Uh, it, the pages are glossy. Then also for each, uh, beginning of the chapter, it's in color. So while we wait for those art books, we can just, uh, you know, hang out with, the uh, the Eternal Edition. Uh, then obviously just the few, uh, pages here are in color as well. I don't know, and what else to say with this? It's huge, it's sparkly. I paid a little bit more at Kino Kunia because I just, I was out shopping with my mom and I just couldn't wait. But you can get cheaper kind of versions of this out there. Um, and I, on the back here it says the new, uh, definitive edition of the classic manga. And I do really feel like... If you've been waiting on getting the manga, you know, this is perfect to uh, dive into. Oh, look, it's so sh You can't really see it in the video, but it's super shiny and glittery. So, yeah, um, that's all for this uh, month's haul. I'm in a, on a little bit of a ban until November, so I should have some <laughs> more videos then. But if you have any questions, comments, put them below. Like, subscribe. Uh, turn on your notifications for more unique Sailor Moon reviews. See you later.